What's up? What's happening? What's going on? Welcome back to another episode of um of I'm absolutely 100% prepared for this. Hold on. I can never get the angle right. There we are. Okay. All right. Now, we will hopefully be able to finish the breath at the breath's edge, breath's edge, edge's breath, the breath. Now, are we, are we on the edge of the breath? Is that, or, or are we breathing on the edge? Oh my God, the chickens are so loud. Chickens, calm the fuck down. Holy shit. Okay. Um, anywho, the chickens have no chill. Just in case you were curious, there's, there's no chill when these chickens, um, I don't even remember what I was saying. The chickens, the chickens made me lose it. Oh, am I going to have to restart the game? I don't know why, but like lately with Brett's edge, it will do this where it's just a black screen when I first load it up and it'll stay like this indefinitely. I have to close it by using the ye old task manager. And then I have to reopen it again, which means we have to listen to the stupid chickens again. I love chickens, don't get me wrong, but they're very loud chickens. And there's nothing I can do about it. It's just erroneously loud. Okay. Are you are you done being are you are you are you gonna load now? This is all we did last time to fix it, but it's not fixing it this time. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, you know? It's not working. It's not doing it's not doing the do. Why is it not doing the do? That's the real question because it was doing the do before. We've almost, ah, there it is. Holy crap, does it take forever. Oh my God. Hi, Blade. Hi, BK. How are you? I hope you're doing good. Are you, are you doing good? You are good? Perfect. That's what I like to hear. Be better once this move is over. Uh, I, uh, yeah, no, I feel you. As somebody who's moved multiple times in my adult life, it is um, always a pain in the ass. Especially the last time I did it because I was in a real hurry because the landlord was, was doing illegal shit. Um, so I was in a hurry to get out. Um, and, uh, so I, 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 yeah, I moved in like a week and by God, that was hard because I like had to find a place and then we had to find, I had to find, um, I found movers at the time, then schedule everything. And of course, you know, when you move, you've got, you know, all the utilities you have to have turned on and then you got to go find different, you know, find different companies to buy most of those from depending on you know, your options. And it's just, it's a whole thing. It costs a million dollars and it takes weeks of your life. And I hate it. I hate moving. I don't remember what we were doing when we were um, last doing this, but it was something. Get to Normandy. 
You know, the really funny thing is, I feel like I remembered more last time when I had skipped a stream to play Diablo than I remember this time, which is really saying something about my memory. Um, Happy Lama Sad. Yes. Derb Lama, Super Lama, Drama Lama, Big Fat Mama Lama. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. What was I actually doing? Like, what was I actually doing? Well, I'm really excited for you, uh, BK. I hope, ev I, you know, I hope everything's good and you're not too stressed out. I'm going to real quick, since I have all the oxygen known to man, now that I equip the world's greatest fucking... Uh, we spent like half the time last time trying to craft this oxygen tank, which is totally worth it because it gives me almost 300 oxygen, which is a, which we were working with 100 before, so it's way better. This game is actually so much more fun with my scooter and my big oxygen tank. Again, my main complaint with this game is pacing. Game is great. They should have paced it a little bit better. I'm giving you some of the shit earlier. Would have been less of a slog to get here. Yeah, the space scooter. Exactly, BK. Exactly. Oh, and if you guys haven't seen, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go ahead and do. I'm gonna do a little. I never do this. I'm gonna shout, I'm gonna shout out my own store and say that you guys should, even if you don't buy anything, you gotta go check it out. Cause, cause, and I'm in the process of getting the rest of them uploaded, but the wonderful Caddy Cat has helped me with product photos. And, um, and they look, just look so good. I just, I love them. They make me want my own stuff, which I already have, but I want, <laughs> but I want, they're so good. Uh, so definitely, give that a look and 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 appreciate the photos because they are so good like i said i still have to upload half of them uh we're not totally totally done but um but what's there is really good i'm really happy with everything Where was I actually going? That's the question. For edible and drinkable soap. No, 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 BK. Don't eat the soap or drink the soap. Oh, there is bacon soap now, too, by the way. There is bacon soap under the Castile soap category. Um, I decided to just see if I could make soap out of bacon. And uh, I, I'm very happy with how it turned out. It turned out every bit as good as I'd hoped. It's basically just like the Castile soap, but made with bacon instead of olive oil, which just makes it like 100% more American <laughs> because it's made with bacon. Oh. Uh, where was the storage container that had all the beef? Here we go. I'm going to take... May as well take three of these. You know what? I'll leave one for emergency food. I'll take the others. That's what I'll do. Because I'm going to need that. I also need to make more water. This whole time, I've just been surviving on the water I find. Because you do they do give you a lot, but... When you're in an area for a long enough period of time, you just kind of use up all the water that's there. And you either got to go somewhere else or go find ice. And I think I'm just going to go somewhere else. It wants me to go to the Normandy, which is probably that. But. But.
Oh, and for those of you, for the for anyone looking at the site, there is a couple of new soaps. Um, and there is one new perfume, which is phenomenal. Everyone already is interested in it, from what I can tell. It is perfume, not cologne, uh, and is very, very floral. So if that's not your jam, then uh, that is understandable. Because admittedly, it's not mine. Oh, shit. Admittedly, it's not mine either. But, um, you know, I know that it is some people's, and so therefore... There we go. I have this real bad habit of shooting my scooter with my laser pistol, which sucks because it does so much damage. Um, I feel like I need to go recharge on oxygen again. Am I really going to go over there? I mean, I can, is the thing. Is that going to be the end? Here's what's weird. I don't know how close I am to the end. Because every time I think I'm getting near the end, they, like, give me more stuff to do. So I have no idea where they've actually planned the end to be. Guess we'll find out, won't we? I'm going to get a full tank of oxygen again. Find my scooter. And then drive it to that. Because I don't know what this Normandy is. But there's some, there's a, there's a special Star Trek style icon. 2,000 meters this way. And with my scooter and my big ass oxygen tank, I should be able to make it. Because we're already, we already cut it down to 1,500. You know, maybe a situation because this game likes to copy some Nautica a lot, right? And that's not, I'm not knocking it for that. I think that's a good thing. But, uh, like some Nautica, it may be that you can finish the game very quickly if you so choose to. Because some Nautica can either take you a very long time or no time at all, depending on how you go about it. And if you my calculations, the next decrease in the radiation level will occur in 17 hours when the shell of the core overheats. The decrease in the radiation level will be significant, and it will last from 3 to 10 seconds, after which the explosion will follow, splitting us into atoms. With this in mind, it's highly recommended that you hurry. What the fu- uh, Yeah, I'm working on it. Holy shit. The core's gonna go supernova and kill us all, vaporize everything. We can't- can't be having that. Don't worry. I've got a scooter. Caddy Cat, hello, welcome in. If I'm not mistaken, there's an accelerating transport station ahead. Hold Apparently, on. Apparently, they plan to use it for the evacuation of Normandy, although it's hardly possible to do that. These stations help small spaceships gain initial acceleration when departing from the liner, but they are of no use for long distance flights. Huh. Interesting. Um. I have to actually pause the game. Playing DVD and lurking, love you. Hi. Hi, Caddy. Don't you worry, I've got the cat ears for you, catty cat. You missed me gushing about you earlier, but that's okay. It's probably for the best. <laughs> hey, they actually worked this time. <gasps> oh. <laughs> yeah, I was I was I was gushing about you earlier and uh and 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 telling everybody to go and check out the pictures. Because they're awesome and amazing. Um, I just want to go reread what he said. Where is what he said? Accelerating transport station. Apparently they plan to use it for the evacuation of the Normandy, although it's hardly possible to do that. Okay. Well, they were trying something, anything, you know. 
hell is all this? Oh no, those are asteroid turrets. I have to be careful. No way to There's just one question that tickles my mind. Why are there so many damaged coffins? Aside from that, these coffins have limbs, weapons, and undoubtedly active AI units, judging by the weak signals coming from their remains. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the coffins grew sentient and, and, and started attacking. You haven't figured that out yet? Dude, there's a ton of lasers. I have to avoid them all. To be honest, I'd rather not know what all of this means. Damn, though. Damn. I do know. Whoa. <laughs> it's the car, baby. Hold on. Where's my scanner? Tell me I have a working scanner. I am an idiot? I think. I think I'm an idiot. Guys, I think I'm an idiot. I came all the way over here and I don't have a scanner. Well, that's fun. Hardly matters if this is the end of the game, though. There should be no guns on such a shuttle. Apparently, they made an exception for Normandy. Why did they make an exception for Normandy? They put guns on a shuttle? That's probably not good. Oh. The functioning nominally, but it will take a little effort if we are going to fly away from here. Huh. Interesting. Huh. It's just a uh... Ooh. The steering wheel is broken, but the rest is in order. This is the Normandy autopilot course. We can't change it without a living captain in any way, not even with a handy scrapper. However, it's highly unlikely that the captain calculated such a complex route for no particular reason, so we'd better not touch it at all. I need some time for analysis. <laughs> Yeah, you're probably right about that. I'm actually going to have to turn this up some. There we go. Uh, install filtration system. I don't have one. Hey, look. Captain's chair. I love this. I think this is awesome. I... I'm... I'm very hyped for this. What is happening in here? Why is there like... Why is there like Russian folk music? Where the fuck... Where... Where is that coming from? And why is Commander Shepard here? Captain of Normandy. Oh, I get it. I get it. Guys, remember? I said last time when they mentioned the Normandy, the first thing I think of is Mass Effect. Well, here's a Commander Shepard reference. Captain of Normandy. Yeah, it's Mass Effect reference. I love it. Oh, that's great. I love, I love how many references are in this game. I really do. Why is my spacesuit? I don't understand how I'm putting a spacesuit in here when I'm still wearing it, but that's fine. I don't know. I absolutely love... What does the kitchen do? Oh, it's the radio. I didn't realize the radio was right here. I knew it was the radio. I didn't realize it was right there. Huh. Well, I'm absolutely not changing the channel because this is glorious. What is... Repair the Normandy? I mean... Oh, I needed to make a scanner. Bro. I need a scanner and I probably need... Oh, I need a bunch of materials. Battery, plastic, light bulb, metal. If we can find, like, one... Um, like, recorder, one of those, like, radios or recorders that are, what, 
I'm so curious. Yeah, I'm thinking... It seems that the Normandy team died heroically fighting with Coffins, which goes beyond any and all logic. On the other hand, the fact that you are still alive goes beyond any and all logic as well. In this regard, there's a chance that the Coffins might be aggressive. It's recommended that you look around carefully and try to find some survivors. Yeah, the crew of the Normandy did fight. Die heroically fighting autonomous Coffins, but the question is why? These robots don't have any built-in weapons. I wonder where they got so many blasters. The lack of weapons in the military module hints at a definite answer, though. Yes, it does. What the hell happened in here? Huh. It's fascinating. Absolutely fascinating. Um. Okay, so there is a whole new thing I have to do. Understood. So we have to repair the Normandy, but... <laughs> what the hell? Okay. But what I have come to find <laughs> is that every time you get to a new area, they give you a bunch of shit to do. So we just got to a new area. So I have to go there, 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 um, there. Basically, everything that requires repair, which is almost everything in here, requires I go to a different area. I'm, I'm assuming it's one area per item. That's the way games usually work. Sorry, I lost it when I came in here and that was playing. Oh my god. How is it that I already have to leak? What the hell? Okay, wasn't something like right here there is uh, I still need a scanner though fuck I may have to go like you can't do without some repair work here maneuver engine yeah dude I need to go get like everything I own and bring it over here you know what I mean but I I don't think we could do that maybe I can it's just a bit of a trip really Right? Where was the nearest thing? Hmm. I don't know. I may still be better off finding what I need in this debris. Hoping that it has what I need in this debris. That's the other thing. Because, like, what I want right now is a radio. So I can break it. So I can get the shit that's inside of it. What the hell happened here? These coffins are insane. What the shit? Hello? It's him, undoubtedly. The legend of the cosmic forces of self-defense. Be careful. Quicksand textures killed a lot of heroes. What? I have no idea what reference, what this is a reference to. But I appreciate it. What? Captain Felicia Sheepsworth, access level the highest. <laughs> Commander Shepard, Felicia Sheepsworth. Looks like the captain had his own fan club. The female fan's face somewhat resembles the face of the captain, though. If you put a wig on it, add some makeup here and there. No, it can't be. It's a Fem Shep reference. Because everyone always... Made, they made so many. Um, and later on, the games allowed you to play as female Shepard. Uh-huh. Yeah, exactly, BK. It's it's a fucking Fem Shep reference. I love it. I'm taking it. Oh, shit. Um, what is this? What the hell? Settle down game, right? <laughs> Daddy. Yes, I, 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 I happen to be a Fem Shep appreciator, but that should be no news to anyone. I, I... <laughs> 
The strongest biceps in the galaxy even ripped off from the hubris. The biceps muscle of the shoulder still remains tense and radiates heroism. What the, I don't understand that. What's that a reference to? Okay, so I also don't... Why is this happening? I don't think that's supposed to happen. I think that is very broken, is what I think. There we go. Red-headed space mommy? Yes. 100%. 100%. I am nothing if not a fan of such things. Where is... Okay, well, I'm going to recharge my oxygen real quick while I take note of what I need to fix the steering wheel and to build a maneuvering, maneuvering engine. That always gets me. What do I need to build? Oh, I have to scan it. I need to build a scanner. It means I have to go find those materials. That is my only option. Not what I wanted. I have to find materials, and if I have to go back, then I have to go back. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go back. I'm gonna have to go back and get a bunch of the rarer resources, like the batteries and the light bulbs and stuff, and and grab it which shouldn't be too bad with my handy dandy scooter yeah because we're only we're closing in on 1500 meters away isn't too bad I do have to leak though So, once we get there, that's what I'm going to go do. I probably shouldn't fly through that because I took off the electrical suit. I guess I could put it back on, you know. I'll just put it back on. It's a bit of a jaunt. Which is why I didn't want to do this, but there's virtually no debris over there. Which I feel like they did on purpose. You know? Because they're like... Because they're like, they take you over there where there's nothing. And then they're like, you got to fix everything on the ship. And you have to build a bunch of complex items to do so where there's no materials. And I'm like, well, I, 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 dude, it would have been so much easier had we done this over here. I have multiple bases worth of materials over here. But like light bulbs, we're going to get a, a couple of them. We're going to get some elastic some wire I think I already I have no I'm just gonna take four wire a little bit of resin you know I'll go ahead and put those up I don't know if I'm gonna need alkali or not definitely gonna leave the grenades here hmm Nah, that should be enough of that. And what was the other stuff? Okay, I need to leak. I'll be right back. I'm a potato.
Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Ami, hello. Welcome in. Love to see you. I hope you're doing good. Sorry, I was AFK for so long. I realized I also had to get refill my beverage. Uh, I need to... Like, ah, uh, you know? You know what I mean? I'm gonna go ahead and eat that. We need to make some water. But we're gonna have a problem soon. Didn't I say that last time I was here? I did. Well, ice exists, right? In space. A lot of it. Do we just have to find it? If all else fails, I could drill. But I don't think I need to do that because there's a whole, like, place over here full of materials if I just go over this way up to that up there surely there's water in here plus I can restock on some other materials is this was that experimental module that had this chicken xenomorphs in it and yes they were in fact Xenomorphs that were like bred with chicken DNA. It was weird. I was like, what are you doing? And then we accidentally launched them. And um, we're just kind of hoping that they don't appear somewhere and be a pro and, and become a problem. What is? Ooh. Aha, you can't hurt me now. I have the anti hurt suit. What is this? And an immortal chicken. Okay, well. Like I said, I could just pick up a little new trash over here, you know? There's so much stuff. Uh, where am I? Oh. Oh. Dude, I don't remember. I don't remember this. When did we do this? When did this happen? When did this happen to us? Huh. Yeah, I mean, I remember this room, obviously. Hey, did I leave water in this room? Do you guys have any water? Aha. This is why everywhere I go, I try to leave a little bit of food and water in case I have to go back there later in dire need of food or water. I really thought there was more though. Aha! I knew. Inventory full. Well, it's about to not be because I'm going to drink two of those. There we go. Take those free oxygen candles. They're even large ones. I don't know why I'm scared. There's nothing on this ship. I just don't trust it because it's the alien ship. Okay. It's the one with the mutated xenomorphs that for some reason someone decided they needed to create using chicken DNA. Like, what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> all right, so that's all we're going to do there. Now, just kind of go back to our little space scooter. I wish we had this space car. I'm turned around. I don't know where I'm going. I think I've... Yep, I found it. I just thought of something mighty smart of me. And that is that I can craft... <gasps> no, wait. There we go. And that is that I can craft... the scanner and stuff while I'm here. 
and that should free up inventory space for more materials, ideally. See, I told you there was a bunch of water over there. And some other supplies. I also should fill this scooter again. Because it'll also free up inventory space because I have a couple cans of fuel. So let's let's do a little inventory management here. Where's oh, there we go. let's fill the sucker up. There we go. Right up to full, basically. And that frees up. God, I hate how much I float around everywhere. Um so I need a scanner, create metal and a battery. Out of all that stuff, I didn't have a battery. No. Well, that's an issue because I don't know where I'm going to get one. Well, I'll put that there for right now. I built this because I figured it would be for something, but I've yet to actually use this. Kenotron. But given that it was unlocked as a craftable option, I figured at some point I would use it. So far, I haven't needed it. Well, we have to get batteries, and I don't know... how far away I'm going to have to go for that. I am very, 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 very grateful that I have so much oxygen now because it actually makes this game so much less infuriating to play. Um, Because, like, I can choose to just go down here now and check out my little base without having to have multiple stops along the way or suck down a bunch of oxygen candles. I don't know. It was just... Tedious. But it's so much better now. I'm gonna check. I don't think anything useful is in here. There's honey. And more water. Which is always good. And this dude. And... Another light bulb, but we don't need that. More water. Don't need that, but we do know where to get it now. See, I can actually take a detour and still have enough oxygen to go to my, my base that I built over here, which I'm hoping has batteries in it. I'm hoping I have at least one. Somewhere. That would be ideal. There we go, there we go. Now. Ugh. Um, no, probably if there are any supplies, I think I remember putting all the supplies over here. I just shat a bunch of supplies on the ground. Yeah, like a magnet, which I'm probably going to need at some point. I actually have plenty of light bulbs somehow. There's also that whole base in there, but it doesn't have what I need. I think the nearest location with a shitload of supplies is going to be the little... little base I have. Although, did I ever fully check this out down here?
There's a lot of debris, but none of it is what I want. So we're going to stick with the original plan. There's another engineering shuttle over here. And that one has a fuckload of storage on it. And we, um, I put a crap load of things in there. I mean, I'll go ahead and refill. Why not? This thing's free. Um, but yeah, I don't need any of this. Where is my scooter? I'm always losing it. Here we go. Okay. Now we're going to go over here and see if there's like a sh bunch of batteries or something. Because there should be. I hope there is, because that's actually... I mean, I can craft them, technically, but I don't want to use up all my alkali doing that because I don't have a lot. And then I'd have to go get more alkali and it's just... Just be better because I know I have a bunch of materials somewhere. But since they gave me all these different, like, areas, rest stops, so to speak, here we go. Here we go. Hi, Lenny. What's happening? What's going on? How are you? I hope you're doing good. This spacesuit takes up a lot of inventory space. You know? I mean, it's real stupid because it's just not even. Hmm. Hmm. You know what I mean? Just hmm. 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 You got a five star and star rail. Are you having a good time with that game, Lenny? Would you say that maybe you like that game a little bit? Is it fairly decent as a game? I just know they're going to want me to have lead paint for something. I just know it. Because they always do this to me. I'll go, I don't need lead paint. And then they'll be like, you need lead paint. I'll be like, fuck. How many batteries? Probably just two. I'm, I'm trying to decide what I need to bring a lot of. Bet you I need glass. Well, that's about everything. Uh, what was the first thing I needed to build? It was... Scanner, which requires a battery. So I'll just make one. As long as I'm making one. Oh, I can't make two. Never mind. I won't be making two. Oh, I used my only metal. Is that metal? Hello? Metal? Somehow I have no metal. I don't know how that's possible. There's literally metal floating in space and I somehow don't have any. Um... Where is... Oh, here it is. 
Here it is. One. I know I'm gonna need more than one. Weird that it's kind of rare over here. I think I used a bunch of it before. And that's why. Oh, my inventory. Can I have a bigger inventory, please? That would be nice. Scanner. What was the other thing? Well, I have room for some more materials now. So... I could just build another battery. No, I need, I need metal. Which I just got over here. Perfect. Build a battery. Maybe several. Ooh. Hmm. Huh. I'm going to need more alkaline. Dude. All these tools take up half my fucking inventory. Um, yeah. I mean, that's it. That's all there is to that. So I could leave a steak here and go get one more alkali somewhere. Where's that drill? There it is. Oh, that's what I'll do. I'll try and grab one more I'm alkali. A potato. You're a potato? Hi, Ami. How are you doing? I hope you're doing good. Ah, oh, where's the... Where it is. Hi, hi. Hi. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I'm doing good. We're just, um, trying to finish this game that has ended up being way longer than I thought it was going to be. Way longer. So now what we have to do is we have to fly all the way back and craft all the things that it wants. I think what I'm going to do is fill up on oxygen here, right? And then just head straight there. Because I do have a lot of oxygen now. And we're almost full up on fuel. So we should be able to just go straight there. I am eating dinner. But also all we're doing is flying through space, so... Because we have to go... Where do we have to go? 
Go over there. We have to go over there. Yeah, because from here, I do believe it's straight over there. It's over there. It's where all the fist icons are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll fill up on oxygen here and then head over to, to those fist icons. waiting on this oxygen to fill up basically I don't even know why I opened the crafting thing because I don't remember what I need to craft <clears throat> okay so our oxygen is full can't really craft anything here I don't know what I need to craft. I still have a bottle of water, so we're good on that. Now we just head straight over there. I hope that doesn't shock me, because I'm not wearing the anti-electricity suit. Because that suit sucks. The only thing it's good for is negating electricity. It's radiation protection stucks. It's like poo poo level radiation protection, okay? It's pretty bad. Also, I love that this game is just like so full of references and also it doesn't take itself seriously. It's it's very funny. It makes a lot of jokes. I love that. Really appreciate that. Like we're going back to repair the Normandy and in the Normandy, there's a bunch of Mass Effect references. <laughs> uh, it's great. The developers of this game clearly had a sense of humor and clearly were pretty passionate about this game. It's also really easy to get lost in how big and beautiful it all is. Alright, here we go. Alright, and we're back. So, let me just do a heckin' save here. Now, what did I need? A maneuvering engine for that. What? What's it take to build a maneuvering engine? Generator, compensator, okay. Ooh, will I have enough? I don't know. gonna take like all my items to build this yeah I need to go get more what else do we have
Okay. Um, you gotta find some titaniums, you know. Titanium, titanium. Ow. Oh, here we go. There we go. How come it's like, like a goblin switching the radio every time I am in here? Hello, are you going to play anything? I do love what I just decided to play. Um, <laughs> oh, that's right. I had to scan. I'm sorry. I just love this shit. <laughs> Oh, it's so funny. Um, so now I can build a steering wheel. An inductor, titanium, and electronics times two. Well, if I get one more metal and a couple more titaniums is, I don't know what it what it is, but I'm just always like an appreciator of that kind of like national folk music. Um There we go. How many metals is did I need? I think it was two. Oh, I can go scan this now. Is it not scannable? What the fuck is this? Grogan the Barbarian? Oh my god. It's like a Mass Effect reference, but like a spoof of a Mass Effect reference. It's so funny. And you know what this is? This is a Mass Effect reference and a Spaceballs reference combined. That's what it is. <laughs> this thing is I'm taking this. Well, my inventory is full. I can't take it. Fuck. Okay. Well, never mind. Also, it looks like I'll never get the space car because and he went hard at that ending there. What was I building? An inductor. Why does that seem so loud? <laughs> I love that. That's so good. Is this considered sound or? I don't know. Did that get any quieter? I have no idea. No idea. Um, steering wheel. But uh, <laughs> of the way it trails off to replace. The steering wheel is ready, and it even works. Probably. I like probably. Um. Next, we have to fix these, which we don't have, which I don't even have the blueprints to make. So what we'll have to do is go to those other fist icons. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. I just, I love, I don't know. I just love, I love music like that. Just silly music. Where's the do 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 the fallout music? Because it's all like 
40s slash 50s like um style music it uh it's like it always uh it always it's very catchy it sticks in my head where's the repair tool required well luckily i have exactly one of those that's great it looks perfect it it it's just it's just electrical tape okay we apparently fixed a complex system by just stuffing it full of electrical tape okay i do i do like that that's how we fix stuff where okay so we have to fix the other one Didn't you just say this wouldn't work? Or are we where what are we doing with it? Almost done. <laughs> See what I mean? We fix it by just just taping over all the holes. Like that somehow fixes a complex electronic. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Okay. Well, we do have to fix. Uh, also, I like that I can do all of this on one tank of oxygen because I have like 300 oxygen. That should work. I hope you already repaired such an engine once, but it looked different somehow. Mm. <laughs> well, oh, I never did go up there. Hold on. Let me get fresh oxygen. So I don't know what that is up there. If it's just a duct tape situation, in which case, great. Also, why am I using the obsolete accelerator? What happened to my double trouble jetpack? Was I not do I, did I never get that? No, I never did get that. Was this the fastest thing I had? I guess so. I for some reason I thought I had the double trouble, which I now that I think about it, yeah, I don't remember actually collecting the uh, the other pieces, but I just, I don't know. I thought it was faster. Where's the... Okay. Take my bike. Whee! Do-do-do. Do, do, do. I wish I could have that playing like on my little scooter. Like I want a little scooter radio. I know it's space. Shut up. I don't care about your reality. This is a video game. Uh Great job. Unfortunately, the station's control units are still broken, but the good news is that you don't need them to launch Normandy at all. I just wanted to keep you busy while I was doing some important calculations. Oh my god, I hate you. I hate him. You're an asshole. <laughs> the hell happened here? Hello? You were just gonna touch the plants? Huh. They are pretty plants. What is this? Huh. No. I don't want it. No. No, 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 that thing's creepy. I don't want anything to do with that. Um, so, but what we haven't figured out yet is why the cop, we figured out that the coffins rebelled and got a bunch of fucking blasters out of the military module and then just started killing everybody. And we know that green, green mutant, green nation, I forget what it's called. They're an eco-terrorist group. They, um, they're the ones that are responsible for the ship being destroyed. But then, and we also know that they were, Brett's Edge was doing illegal biological experiments, creating xenomorphs with chicken DNA. Um, and, um, and, 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 and yeah, and we got coffins the coffins of, of the Breath Ed's funerary uh, arm 
like rising up and, and fucking killing people. So I have no idea what's happening with this game. I feel like that's on purpose. Because there's just a lot of plots going on at one time. Wait, I can decrypt this? No, I need to have a tape. Well, how do I get these? I have none of the systems. That's it. Space, here we come. Start the engine. Shepherd's grave. Debris in orbit. Unavailable. Unavailable. Wait, what? Warning after making the warp jump, you won't be able to return temporarily. Um. Hmm. Interesting. But those are still broken back there. Oh, well. No, uh, give me one second. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, guess we just go, huh? Whoa. Whoa, that's very loud. Holy shit. Well, you know this game is on like 12 volume. It's amazing to me. Nobody normalizes their, their audio anymore, and that really, really gets to me. Even AAA games will have stuff like that. Whoa! What's happening? You can change Normandy's control mode, Chapter 4, I apologize babe? for the restart window. I'm not good with abrupt acceleration. I hope we don't need the parts of the ship that fell off along the way that much. <laughs> In any case, Normandy won't survive one more acceleration, or any flight at all. I suggest we find a place to dock and inspect the shuttle. Oh By my... the way, I'd like to note that leaving the shuttle and going into outer space at such a short distance from the core is impossible unless you want to turn into jelly. <laughs> oh my god, I love him. Your signal change. Are you... Are you fly on Normandy? Team alive? They kill you. Don't trust them. You must Paranoia take control and find me. psychosis common for adulthood. Either your interlocutor knows something we don't, or she's an old woman. Yeah, I have no idea, but I love that you can fly the ship. The ship won't hold up long, so take your time. Oh my god, shut up. We don't have enough engine power to activate the weapons. Aw. Not enough power. Alright, well, we'll just fly to where we need to go, huh? I do like having a shuttle now, though. Look at this. But I have a feeling I'm not going to get to keep using it. Man, it's pretty slow, though. Dolphin, hello. Nyom. How are you doing, King? Welcome in. Love to see you. I hope you're doing good. Doom. I love that emote, by the way. That emote is so cute. Doing okay? How are you? I'm doing good. 
I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm just driving the world's slowest spaceship, apparently. <laughs> That's a suitable place to dock. Looks like a part of the liner's garage module. Maybe we'll find some parts for Normandy there. But we'll we'll get there eventually. We'll get there eventually. We're <laughs> do be a bit slow. It is. It is. We're supposed to be looking for repair parts because it's kind of broken. So far, I like this game. I like it a lot more now that I've gotten a lot of stuff. It's basically Subnautica in space. Just without... I do wish there were, like, creatures, like in Subnautica, but they don't really have that. Ooh. There's a system for accurate docking installed here. That's great. Um, or perhaps for not so accurate docking. It looks like the engine's failed completely now, and we'll never get to the accelerating station. No, my God. This game hates me. This suit AI hates me. The AI in my spacesuit hates me. Ooh. Was there anything in here? Oh, there wasn't. Oh, but there could be. Oh. Oh, I need... Oh. I need nutritious goo. Please go to the reception. Welcome. Go to the center. Please. Oh, more. Error, error. Welcome, diagnostics. <laughs> Please go. Oh, yeah. In. Error. Welcome to the diagnostics. <laughs> yes. What the hell? Reception. Welcome. What is happening out here? This is not just a garage module, but a surviving diagnostic station. However, it doesn't sound like it's functioning nominally. I have to agree with you, spacesuit. It definitely does not sound like it's functioning normally. Why? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, don't worry about it, Dolphin. I have no idea what's happening. I have no idea. This game is wacky. This game is really silly. Uh oh. It looks like he was accidentally killed by the diagnostic station. I can't find any other reason for this injury. Dude, he was stomped. The hell? What killed him? Uh, ooh. This worker apparently saw the death of the previous one and started running away, not looking where he was running and without a helmet. <laughs> this game. Oh my god. Uh Yeah, we'll just take one more of those. Why is there so many supplies? Why and why am I concerned? I'm very concerned about all the supplies they're giving me. Like really actually quite concerned. <laughs> the diagnostics panel works, although this part clearly doesn't belong here. What um the hell is this? Taking all these batteries. Hey! Don't touch it! Put it back! What are you doing? Put it back! Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that's better. <laughs> Can you twist it a bit more? I think at this rate we'll achieve nothing because this thing is short-circuiting the diagnostic station's brains. Um... Yeah, let me just um remove that. What now? Put it back. Are you messing around with me? Put it oh yes, back in. <laughs> oh, you jerk. This diagnostic station is faulty, but we don't have any other one. The excess voltage is melting its circuits. You need to bring it to its senses somehow. Bring me back to your senses, you dirty undies with a helmet. <laughs> what are you talking about? Okay, I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> The way from the horny AI. We can't do anything here. We'll have to look for some controls. You better look for the remnants of your dignity, you lousy pajamas. <laughs> what? I have to say, out of all the things I thought I would come across in this game, a horny AI is not one of them. How do you get over there?
There has to be a way. Wait, are you serious with me right now, game? Are we doing switchbacks? Okay. The elevators aren't working. Although, it's not recommended to use elevators during a fire, earthquake, or the diagnostic station self-torture. Diagnostic station self-torture. So, like I said, but let me add a qualifier. I didn't expect to encounter a kinky, horny AI in this game. Why can't I? Okay, there we go. Um, the main diagnostics room. You can say that this is the brain of the whole diagnostic station. And this brain is malfunctioning. You are the one who's malfunctioning, you funerary diaper. <laughs> Dude, I, I love her comebacks, though. They're so good. The central processor. I thought such a fragile thing should be protected somehow and not be just sticking out of the floor like this. I stick out and in however I want. <laughs> the central processor protection control console. Uh, create and install the dome. No, something's wrong. Create and install the dome? What are you talking about? What, what dome? What dome am I going to create? Um, processor dome required. Uh, is there a crafting station on this station? Is that a... I have no words for this. It's okay, Dolphin. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I have no words for it either. From the inside. I got, I got no words. There should be a voice control module at the station here, as well as its speech filters. Maybe that's why it keeps calling us names. That's not why. Um, well, maybe it's because you're a useless garment that keeps babbling too much. <laughs> Rebecca Black Monday, 18 hour cycle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love this. Uh, is there can we is is can we can we listen to that? Is there like a tape player? I want to listen to it. I'm I'm taking this. What kind of monsters played an 18-hour recording of this song? It looks like this recording is the reason why the station's entire voice module burned down and it became so aggressive. <laughs> because someone put Monday by Rebecca Black on an 18-hour loop and destroyed the AI? <laughs> is that what happened? Oh my god. Ah, <sighs> oh, this game. This game. Here, I guess I'll just... There we go. Um, let me just take one of those. What else? There was something else I needed in here, right? Mm, ah, gravity module. Cause I can't even make those. I don't know what those are even for, but I'm sure I'm going to need it. So I'm going to take it. I need a crafting module. Do we have a crafting module? A, a uh, a, a le crafting module, perhaps. I don't know why I keep getting stuck on stuff. It's probably me. It's probably me. I'm um still getting used to this new keyboard, which is like like extra sensitive, and so I accidentally hit keys a lot or hold down keys longer than I'm supposed to, and so that's a problem. Are they going to make me go all the way back to my ship? They are, aren't they? Well, at least I will give them one thing. They're giving me all the materials like I could ever need. But I'm still fairly salty that they're going to make me go back to my ship to craft this dome. Because they made it take forever to get to the core. Mm, I probably don't need lead, right? All right? Where the heck is my ship? 
taken. Well, at least it's not like out in space. At least I'm docked. Although they did just drop my ship. Oh no, the game. The game is. The game is, um. Uh, the game. Okay. Oh man, the game was doing that thing where, it, like, I'm assuming it it loaded areas, right? It changed the area that I was in, and it froze everything when it did that. Processor dome, non-conductive gel, lead, and wire. Well, that's not too bad. I'm gonna go ahead and put like everything in here. Because I'm going to probably have to craft everything from here anyway, right? Mm -hmm. um, I think I know where to get that gel from. Lead times four and wire times two. Well, I know how to get that. It's over here. Lead... What was it? Lead times four, I do believe. And the conductive gel times two. Which, if I remember right, conductive gel was in those giant cylinders. These. Is there any over here? This. Tank with gel. Magnetic master key required. Can I make one of those? Is that something I can make? Is that... Is that like a thing? I don't think I can make one of those. What the hell? Yeah, I don't... Ah, uh, well, we're just going to have to go and look for the gel. Because I don't have a magnetic master key, nor can I make it. So we're going to have to just look around until they either give me the key or the ability to make the key. Or the gel. I'm cool with that, too. But given how many of these tanks are here, I doubt it. Doubt it pretty heavily. Man, I keep wanting to stop for all the food, but I don't need it. I don't need it. All of these are locked, and I need some kind of master key I don't have to unlock them. Can I? Hmm, I see. Someone removed the protection from the processor and tried to connect it directly to the coffins. I don't know why anyone would want to run diagnostics on coffins, but the result is obvious. Yeah, the result is obvious. It fried the coffins. Melted data blocks from the coffins. Judging by the remains of the wires, the blocks were roughly... Pour out in a hurry, which means the person who pulled them out was rough and in a hurry. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what that means. Good job, game. I love this game's humor so much. Um, here, hello. Can I get in? It says green. Can I not get in? Apparently I'm not allowed. So I'm going to go in this way. I was already here. This doesn't help me. I need some kind of master diagnostic key. Or master magnetic key. Sorry. But I don't know where to get it. And that door, this door looks like it should open. But it's like totally not opening. Hello? Hello? No? Okay. Well, I guess... Find some controls. 
Well, dude, I don't... I don't have the gel. Nor do I have the stuff I need to make the gel. I do have a lot of rubber, though. The processor control panel. We can restart the whole station with it. It looks like we'll have to remove the excess voltage first. Yeah. Well, I don't know how they expect me to get this, like, non-conductive gel. When I don't have the key, I need to extract the gel. You know? Well, I could take all these materials back to my ship and double check to make sure I can't make the gel. But I don't think I can. Hey, this one... Oh no, it is locked. Never mind. I was going to say it doesn't look locked, but it is. It is. Darn it. Gosh darned it. Hmm. <laughs> so, the problem I have is I'm kind of dumb. So... It's entirely possible that I'm just missing something, like, really easy. And I hope that's not what it is. Um... Okay, so... See, that's the thing. I need this non-conductive gel. I have to make sure I don't have some kind of key. Magnetic master key? <gasps> Guys, I was right. I am dumb. I had it the whole time. I'm actually that dumb. <laughs> you know, I had hope. I had hope I wasn't actually that dumb, but um I'm I'm actually that dumb. I had it the whole time. It's right here. Please go to the reception. Um <laughs> So let's just get some. Oh, you have to... Okay. You only get one per cylinder. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, well, I know I need two. I can't believe I was... <laughs> this is like that time. It's not as bad as that time. But I spent 20 minutes looking for a door code that was on the wall. It was like on the wall near the door and I just never saw it. Been 20 minutes trying to find the door code before I realized it was right there. This isn't quite as bad because it took a special tool that I just did, forgot what it was called. But still, where's... Okay, so let's build the processor dome. Feels a whole lot like we're capping off a nuclear reactor. Uh, yeah, I mean, and that's it, right? We just we do this, we save, and we head over there. And then we go trying to fix this um, malfunctioning AI. <laughs> It, um, it got a little masochistic because somebody made it listen to, um, Becca Black song on repeat for 18 hours, which is understandable.
Uh, uh. That. Okay. Um, is that gonna work? Here's a control. Control panel is out of order. Now? Alone. Calm down. If doesn't like it, then we're doing it right. <laughs> what kind of people are you? It looks like the unpredicted processor was causing power supply overload. This should help a little. Uh. You better help yourself, sweat smelling piece of junk. <laughs> I love whoever they got to voice act this. They had fun with it. Um, oh, now I can get through here. Hell yeah. Oh, what is this? This rotor is damaged. It's not quite needed for the diagnostic station's work. It'd be better to turn it off somehow. Are you sure it's not needed? Or am I going to turn it off and we're going to find out we needed it and you're going to somehow make it out to be my fault? These are the levers controlling the rotor's speed. Oh no. Well, why don't we just turn it off? Is that like not an option or if we just we just we pull just... harder. Yes. Pull it out. What? <laughs> um, is there um is there like a particular way? not working. You should first press the left one, then the right one, or maybe the middle one. There are too many combinations. I have no idea how anyone could guess the right one. Yeah, that's kind of... Yeah, exactly. Okay, well... Pull harder. Yes. Pull it out. Pull harder. Yes. Pull it out. Pull harder. Hmm. Yes. Pull it out. Perfect. You managed to... Break nope. the rotor. It doesn't matter, though. Too bad it didn't hit you. What the hell? I was just trying to slow down the rotor, or turn it off, and it just sent it flying through the wall and destroyed everything over here. What is this? Censorship. Unfortunately, the item cannot be displayed in your country. It's called filth, and it's like a Minecraft block. Oh my god, I love this. Uh, that's so funny. That's so funny. Like I said, I love the sense of humor of these developers. Ooh, plastique. Don't mind if I do a little aluminium action. This looks like a passageway to the debugging compartment. Perfect. It does actually. Do, do. Ooh, light bulbs. I think I need those. Take another one of those. Hello, anyone home? I should probably save. I haven't saved in a while. Duct tape. I'm sorry, electrical tape. Basically duct tape. Don't let them lie to you. It's duct tape. Uh, what happened in here? Oh. Yeah, that's what I said. Just, oh? Oh. Ah. I think he offed himself with the blaster. Well, I have another blaster now. So that's good, I guess. Where's... Um, have a, have a good one, bud. Uh, am I going to need this? Is that why you gave it to me? There's something wrong here. I don't know what this dead man was trying to do, but the compensators shouldn't be under voltage. And see, that's the thing. As soon as you were like, I don't know when, what went wrong here. I was like him 
he's what went wrong here. I have no idea what he was doing, but he's definitely what went wrong here. You just grab this, that, some of these, smack this a little bit. It will actually be back to smack that in just a minute. What um, what was he doing? Hello? What were you reading? Alternative engineering. Alternative methodology from another alternatively gifted author. I remember reading this while trying to cure an unpleasant illness. The illness quickly turned into two more illnesses, and I had to urgently turn to traditional medicine. <laughs> The book series in the footsteps of 50 shades. Oh my God. Physical suppression of an object. Oh. 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 Alternative medicine through strangulation. Ah. I know. I know what this book was about. <laughs> the hell were you doing over here though? I have to use this chicken to neutralize the electricity. Don't worry about it. It's totally safe. The chicken's immortal. Uh, the chicken literally cannot die, so... Oh. 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 I know, I know what he was doing. I know what he was doing. And it involves the subject matter of this book. You just, um, just fix this up a little bit. What's going on? Reattach the clips. Oh. There's less stuttering in its voice. Looks like everything is coming along all right. Yep. <laughs> Yes, it does. How did he end up? I'm not going to ask. I am absolutely not going to ask. Okay. Look, I get it. Okay. But still. Probably wasn't the best idea. What do I do here? Repair tool. Hold on. I've got this. Yeah, that's the filtration. Now I can put that on my ship. I needed a filtration system for my ship. This place is huge. Really would have thought that door would have opened. Uh... these broken wires we won't have to break the door probably no yeah that's right we have been in this situation before and we just slapped some electrical tape on it last time and it fixed the problem it's really weird but i'm not gonna oh i see what happened here yeah the robots rebel i mean the coffins rebelled which is so weird no idea why they did that, but, um, just use this chicken to, uh, oh, I forgot about that. We're going to have to, there we go. Oh no, I need a new repair tool. Oh, well, we have to go back to the ship. Which is fine, because I have full inventory anyway, so we probably need to do that. I just didn't want to have to run all the way back over there. But here we go. Hmm. Hmm, you know what? Need some of this. There we go. It's really far when you have to run the entire way. Can these doors open or no? 
See, sometimes they have like green lights on them and it's a little confusing. Hmm, okay. You know, while I'm here, and I can grab some of these, I bet you I'll need it, you know? I doubt I'm not going to need them, because they put them everywhere. We'll take a couple. Hell, we could probably take all the ones we come across. We've got 20 durability, and it's one per, so... Oh. Forgot about my full inventory. Okay, so what was it, um... I can't remember, what was it... What was I... What was it having me do? I've already forgotten. <laughs> I'm gonna go stick all this stuff. Didn't I have to craft something? I had to craft something. Oh, repair tool. Need a new repair tool, that's what it was. So I'm gonna dump all this stuff back at the base. Although I wish there was a crafting station on the station. So I didn't have to go back here every time. Oh no, there we go. Please go to the reception. Okay, and then we come here and we build a repair tool. Oop. And we just kind of shove all this stuff in here. Hmm. That's good enough. Um. Is that all we needed? I mean, I'm already back here. One of these we just got. It was this one. Filtration system required. Didn't I grab the filtration system? Oh, I just have a filter. Okay, never mind. Okay. Well. We made what we needed, so I guess we'll go back. Man, it's too bad there's gravity here. I move faster with my jetpack. They're gonna make me go back and craft something. I know they will. It's gonna take me a second to get back over there, though. This is the kind of thing I feel like um, kind of weighs the game down is this kind of thing. Because the game is good. But it's like all the backtracking. Hmm. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So now we just gotta repair the heckin' the heckin' wires. And we'll be able to do whatever it is we're supposed to be doing. Which I don't actually know. I'm just kind of doing what my suit is telling me to do. And the game did give me a blaster, which concerns me. It gave me a free blaster. Um, here we go. Let me just neutralize this with the chicken. There we are. <laughs> Neutralize. 
don't touch anything. I don't even know if that's a good sign. Yeah, I don't either. But you know what? The door is open, so ooh. Why does I say danger? Should I put on the other suit? I'm putting on the other suit. Putting on the electrical suit. And saving. Ugh, it has a toggle switch. Disgusting. What? Why is that disgusting? Listen. Don't touch I like anything. toggle switches. This should help a little. Although touching a toggle switch, even to survive, I really don't know. Listen, toggles. Push that toggle switch to on. Uh, push it to on. <laughs> now, can you hear it? I can't hear its angry babbling either. Looks like it's time to reboot the central processor. All right, reboot time. It working? What happened? Did you just reboot me by just pushing the button? I take it you'll continue damaging the equipment until I run diagnostics? Well then, uh, the core of your shuttle is melting, the weapons are uncalibrated, passive defense is not installed, active defense is not installed. It's nothing but uh, a tin can. Happy now? Uh, I'll fix your engines and you'll get out of here. Okay. Okay. I mean, I guess that's really all I that's need. That's a good deal. And the only possible one. The diagnostic station is not designed for complex repairs at all. It's time to return to Normandy. By the way, maybe we could fast travel there. I swear to God, game. Really? After I was just bitch- hmm, We're still here. <laughs> Apparently, there's no fast travel in this game. We'll have to go back on foot. That's a shame. Picked out such a nice visual effect, such beautiful sounds, and such a nice loading bar. <laughs> Have you seen it? Oh my god. <laughs> this is this god, this game. They always get you. They always get I was like, are you serious? And then they got me with the double whammy by being not actually serious. Oh, that's good. I love it. Oh, it appears there's no fast travel in this game. <laughs> like, they, well, yeah, it's like they even gave me a little loading bar and everything. Oh, that's so that funny. Already? It's done, by the way. You were saying something about going to the accelerating station. I want to inform you that without a friend or foe system, none of the protective systems of the liner's row will destroy you. Good luck. I'm sure we won't last long without decent repairs, so even the security systems won't be needed for the shuttle to fall apart. <laughs> As for the friend or foe identification system, I don't know anything about it. Well, should we... Is there anything... There's probably nothing she's going to do for us, huh? What the hell are you doing? This robotic arm is just beating the shit out of my ship. What are you... What are you doing? I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm going. Wait, how is all of that? I thought she couldn't fix those. Never mind. I don't care. <laughs> this game is, this game is, this game is one of those you just don't question. Kind of like Blacktail. You just don't ask questions, you know? Don't ask questions. What is this? I still can't move. I shouldn't have said anything about the weapons. I have to warn you about the illegality of shoot. Ah, uh, never mind. Ah, <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, what am I supposed to do? Can I leave? Am I allowed to leave? By the way, the weapons calibrate themselves automatically when shooting at random targets. I have no idea where to look for everything else listed in the diagnostics, and therefore, I suggest exploring the nearest debris. Floor space, create and install a filter system, create and install the navigator. Okay, so they want me to explore to find... To find those things. Oh my god. Oh, I have no experience steering a shuttle. 4,000 meters that way? 8,000 meters that way? What the hell? I mean, I know I'm in a spaceship, but holy shit. Okay, um... What's this? 
Probably should look at this stuff first. Maybe we could salvage something. How do I leave the helm? How do we get off the helm? That's shooting. How do you actually leave the helm? Help. <laughs> you can't. That's a. That's how. Apparently, we have lights on this ship. How do you get? How do you get off? How do you leave the helm? Well, I guess I can't go out there, right? Because didn't he say this close to the ship's core, you'll just turn into jelly? He considers 4,000 meters away nearby. Okay. I'm going to... I'm going to go grab another drink and leak. What's that up ahead? What I'm is... not mistaken, am I? Is it a fully functioning breath edge coffin with hands? We've already seen such coffins, but I doubted it until now. An automatic maintenance team. They can patch us up, but nothing more. We can't get them to completely repair the shuttle. Um, coffin bot station. I'll be back to that. I'm going to, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to grab a drink and stuff. I'll be right back. Okay, and I'm back. Ugh. Everything's still working? Yes. Perfect. Just gotta straighten up. There we go. Okay. Welcome back. Thank you, Lenny. I'm apparently about to piss off a bunch of autonomous and aggressive often robots armed with blasters. But it's okay. Because I have my own blasters over here. Oh, they're mad. Do I have like a heat system in this game? Interesting. Is there an overload? There doesn't appear to be. 
Yeah, suck it, nerds. I'd like to note that your shooting skill is absolutely unimportant here. These weapons have a simplified artificial intelligence with a self-learning system, and they simply adapt to the shooter. <laughs> well, whatever works. I don't give a shit. Uh, the point is, my enemies are dead. Oh, oh, that's a lot of pissed off autonomous coffins. Ooh, they run into stuff, do they? All right. See, but I don't. I'm experienced in flying in shooters. Jeez. I don't even know what to call them. Coffin bots? They are not our friends for sure. No, no. They really aren't. I feel like I'm playing um the Star Wars one, Battlefront. I feel like I'm playing Battlefront right now. Where, where are my enemies? I have no radar, which sucks, but you know. When you're fighting autonomous pissed off robots in a, in a, a salvaged shuttle that for some reason has weapons, you know, you can't, beggars can't be choosers. There he is. He'll run into the wall at that rate. Got him. All right. We only took like one hit, I think. Make that two. <laughs> oh my God. That wasn't even on purpose. Holy shit. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. Oh, oh. Ooh, we get full health back? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Great. We didn't blow up and are back in line. Hell yeah. And we get apparently to do some space combat, which I'm really excited about. I don't know if anybody knows this. Kind of a fan of sci-fi and um space combat. I feel like it goes with the territory if you're like a huge fan of sci-fi like I am. So I destroyed an... Hold on, why are they... I just now noticed. Also, I apologize for anyone with motion sickness or anything like that. Because I know the weird flying around in space and rotating can really mess with you. But why is there... um? There's just like a cable connecting all of this, including the autonomous coffin bot station that I destroyed because it was producing aggressive coffin robots. And I don't know why it's doing that, but we Looks can't like have that. The only part that contained unique observation modules was domed glass. How this glass survived the disaster is a mystery to me, but it would be nice to get inside, at least out of curiosity. You are very correct, and we may, provided I know where the hell you're talking about. Where? Where are you talking about? Up there? 3,000 meters. Ooh. Oh, is he coming for me? I don't think so. If this goes on, we might get something important damaged. We. He, he just barely grazed us with his debris. It's fine. Uh, 3,000 meters that way. Six and four. How is that closer? That definitely looks closer. Somehow it's not. Got him. So... I mean, where are those little bots coming from? You guys got a mothership I need to destroy? Hmm. Okay. 
probably fine. Do I not have a boost on this ship? I don't, do I? No. No, none of these buttons boost. Okay. I'll go top off on repairs and then we'll head to the dome that he was talking about. Meow. Yes. Great. We didn't blow up and are back in line. Mm hmm. That's the idea, my guy. That's the idea. All right. Now, where's this dome? It's over here. Good thing I have a shuttle. Because this would be very, very far without a shuttle. It's very far with a shuttle. Because this is the slowest shuttle known to man, apparently. But someone outfitted it with guns, so I'm happy. I was about to fly into a rock. I'm very suspicious about this area. Especially now that... That the robots are, like, attacking me, you know? So I'm real... According to the number, this is one of the dome cooling modules. The extremely low temperatures overboard and the huge volumes of working fluids allowed the modules to maintain almost any temperature in the shell of the cores without unnecessary energy consumption. We could use something like this for the damaged core of Normandy. Oh, I see. All the damaged pieces on the Normandy, I'm going to have to do, get from, is that a battle going on over there? Hmm. Definitely looks like it. Dude, this liner was so big. Like, it was... An external docking airlock. You can get inside from here. Or rather, you could get inside if you could break all this ice. Easy. Told you. I have a blasterino. Boom. Hell yes. Okay, I like this game a lot more with a ship. This was a good idea. Giving me a ship was a great idea. That's my favorite banger. I don't I don't even know what it's called, but I love it. I have no detailed information about the liner's cooling system in my database, but I'm sure you'll have to find something and break something. Well, those are two things I'm really good at. Well, actually, I'm better at the second one than the first one. Can we skip to the second part? Because I'm just better at breaking stuff than I am at finding it. I wonder if you can call icicles icicles in zero gravity. Technically, they form in a different way, which means they must have another name. Orbicles, for example. <laughs> or, uh, expandicles, versticles, pressuricles. I don't know. I'll allocate one of my processors for generating the name, perhaps. <laughs> oh, no. This door, this door reader has a bloody handprint on it. That can't be good. Well, we can't go in there, so... I guess it's fine. I have a blaster. I actually have two of them. Watch out. I don't remember which button is fire. So I'm dangerous. <laughs> No, well, he didn't make it. Hello, my guy? You, uh... What happened? Also, usually the suit AI says something about these corpses that you find, but it's oddly quiet right now. About it. Concerns me even greater. I'm checking all my corners. 
I don't know what's out there. Or whether or not it wants me dead. It clearly wants everyone else dead. See? This coffin. They want you to believe they're just simple coffins. And then they sprout arms and legs and grab blasters and start shooting. It looks like this is not a passageway leading to the dome, but a temporary storage module. I didn't know it was located in this part of the liner. Neither did I. It says unlock, but the door won't open. So can you really say that it's unlocked? I don't know what these gravity modules are for. But I don't want to need them later and not have picked them up. So, that's what I'm doing. They're giving me a lot of light bulbs, too. So it is. These are temporary storage refrigerators. Everyone who was lucky enough to die during the flight on the liner was placed here. And according to my data, there were many of them. I just, okay. Yeah, I mean, makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, this is ominous, but here we go. Yo, thank you so much for resubscribing. How are you? I hope you're doing good. Love to see you. I really appreciate it. Yeah. What is all this? These cryo? Oh, yeah. Dude, how do you have enough units for all the people that died? There's a... This is... I expected more of like a sardine situation, you know? This is like first class. Like, there's so much room in between these. Let's hope the deceased didn't walk away on their own. Well, yeah, some somebody freaking did. Because it's, it's empty. And it's the only one that's... Well, there's... I guess there's one over there that's empty. Okay, show. No problem. Well, th again, thank you for resubscribing and thank you for coming by. You never... You never have to chat if you don't want to. I just appreciate knowing that you're there. Very interesting. The design of these refrigerators is not that simple. If I had more information, I could make a useful blueprint for Normandy. Why can you open the chamber? I'm not going to do that. Also, I don't think they froze correctly. And also, that man's torso was duct taped together. Is that a problem? Probably not, right? I don't know why I keep jumping. This boulder could be named in your honor. Just look at all the stuff it destroyed. Dude, it did wreck a ton of stuff. Why is there just a boulder in here? Why do you want to name it after me? Because a bunch of stuff has been destroyed. What are you trying to say? Oh. Oh, this man's had one fall on him. He, um... He was doing all right until this box fell on him. Huh. No, don't you? I see that. There's even a hand. And it was not able to break through either. Hmm. Well, what is this then? Is that still alive? Are you still alive? Ooh, I needed that navigation chip. That's actually really useful. Hello? Oh my god, there's so many rooms. Chorizo Joe, what is happening? What is going on? It's been a minute. How are you doing? I hope you're doing good. Hmm. 
Whoa, 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 I don't have no idea what I'm doing. What, what, why? That's a lot of, lot of wheels. Okay. Probably fine. Although I would say that is not. What strange remains? If I make the assumption that coffins can replace the corpses inside them with fresh bodies like batteries, would you think I'm crazy? Is... Is that... Is that what it is? Is that what's going on? Is that... Is that what's actually going on here? What the hell? Why are people in boxes? Like they were just... And that guy's got a cable attached to him. Like he was just, like he was saying, like the coffin was just like taking one out and plugging one in. Like batteries. What it's hard to tell anything from these remains. What is this? Evidence. I was arrested on suspicion of stealing a Phillips screwdriver. Huh. Interesting. Um... Oh. Oh, what is this? You're very, very tired? Well, what, what, what's what been going on, Joe? You just... You just, uh... Doing a lot? I hope that, um... That you get to get some rest soon, and that... Whatever's making you so tired calms down. the heck? Hold on. Despite the damage, the nitrogen valve control unit in this refrigerator remained intact. Huh. Very interesting. Yeah, especially since I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm taking this navigation chip, because these are rare. Oh good, I can use my booster in here. Thank you. This is clearly not just simple steam, but something much colder. Although you could get under the dome from here. Yeah, but I would need to somehow turn off this. Ah. I have no idea what it is or how it works. Examine the refrigerators. Okay, so I still need to learn about the fridges. Which means I'm going to probably need to go over in this general direction here. Well, Joe, if it's any consolation, I love to see you. So I'm glad that we got to. Why are the, all these guys dead? Did the cough I swear, the coffins rose up. Yep. And shot these guys. Like, that's a blaster wound. Deceased has no pathologies or external injuries. He's healthier than you. No external injuries? Huh. And yet he's deceased. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. What? <laughs> Dude, we got ourselves a Star Wars reference over here. With some dude trapped in carbonite. Look at this. Amazing. I can't imagine how this happened, but by looking at the junction box in his hand, I can make a rough diagram of how to connect the refrigerator. <sighs> Looks like I figured out the general concept of integrating thermal control systems, even though I don't have an engineering chip installed in me. All that's left is to study the cooling system controller and figure out where to get the working fluid. Then we can assemble a cooling unit for Normandy. Simple as pie. I want to know why there's a dude trapped in carbonite and why we're not talking about it. Like, what the hell? I really expected the suit to have something to say about that, and he didn't. Looks like acute poisoning. Or stupid poisoning, as he ate a hamster. What? Who ate a hamster? Was it this guy? 
One of these guys ate a hamster, apparently. Well, good job. Good job. So the coffins rose up. And, uh... Find the cooling system controller. It's over here. Coffins rose up for some odd reason. And now we're believing that they are, um... Now it's clear how to disable the flow of nitrogen. Do Turn with the game. A02 valve all the way to the right. Then the three nitrogen reduction valves. Turn the B6 valve to the left at a 30 degree angle. Don't forget to depressurize the valve. Well, or like this. All right, time to check the dough. <laughs> well, there we go. Hell yeah. That's what I... cooling system controller should be here somewhere. We're looking for some sort of a, uh, box? No, probably a computer, or a room, or maybe a data block, or a barrel with a button. I haven't fully studied what it should look like. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, what are these? Bubbles of cooling gel? I love them. Um, I lost everything I was going to say. Wait a second, this mosaic. So that's why your relative's face seems so familiar to me. A brilliant engineer, one of the creators of the core, and the father of artificial intelligence. It's him! Amazing! Are you sure you're not adopted? <laughs> wow, rude suit. My grandfather was amazing, yes. Um, and, uh, was killed shortly before the crash. They didn't even have anything to defend themselves with. Oh, they were killed before the crash? Probably by the coffin bots. What is this? I noticed that it's enough for a human to get one hit in any part of the body to die, whereas coffins only die when certain points on the head and stomach are damaged. Yeah. There's a problem. I got an energy core. And more lycoplasma. Dude, lycoplasma is so rare. Are we going to need alkali? Because out like a lycoplasma is like the rarest thing in the game. Um, and there's just a bunch of it in here for some reason, which is concerning, but it, I think it's okay. And a gravity module, man. Well, you know, I don't need any of this lead. Ooh. There we are. There we are. Um, I have a full inventory. Oh, dude, this guy got. Ow, that must hurt. Well, not anymore. He's dead. But yeah, that. I was rough. According to some sketchy fragments of data, I assume that it might be the office of your grandpa and his team. Did you know that he was supposed to be on board the liner? Well, it's a damn... Good thing he wasn't, I think. Mm. An employee pass is required. I wonder if a handy scrapper will do, or if you'll have to search the bodies. Mm. I'm going to have to search the bodies because I don't have it, but that's okay because uh, they're over here and I ought to be able What is this? Can I scan it? No. But I already searched all the bodies. There's no... Wait, what's... No. Okay. Um...
Hmm. I'm thinking. No? No. It was worth a shot. Uh, I have to search the blobs. Hold on. Nothing of interest. Can't I analyze this? Oh, I think I left my analyzer, didn't I? No, I still have an analyzer. Hold on. Nothing of interest. Oh God, that's loud. Oh, what was that click for? Oh God, why? Game. Seriously. This is what I'm talking about. How did it get louder? I turned you down. I think it ignores volume settings. Yeah. It ignores, well, I'm never using this. I'm never using it. Hold on, I gotta turn it. Maybe if I... No, it ignores volume settings. This device actually ignores volume settings. Oh my god. What the hell? I cannot believe. I can't actually believe that there's a sound effect in this game that ignores that. volume settings. God, I hate that. Oh my god, why? We'll just use this. Well, that's annoying. I'm... You say nothing of interest there too? We're gonna just... I'm just gonna keep poking my head in these. Nothing of interest. Mm. And then this one. Solids detected. Solids. Where? Oh, hello. An employee pass. Victor. The um, deceased is on the ship's crew list. I've checked. I don't know why, though. Maybe he wanted to be. Also, how do I get out of here? Ugh, there we go. All right, well, I got what I needed, which was the employee pass. 